This is MMA Outbreak. Time for the second fight on today's Odds Breaker segment. Another huge fight, main event from UFC 149 that takes place July 21st, 2012 from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. The main event is a title fight between Jose Aldo and Eric Koch. Now we're going to start off with Luca Fury first on this one. Not a surprise here, Jose Aldo is going to open up the favorite, but I'm going to open a minus 385. The comeback on Koch is going to be plus 285. So Luca Fury, give me your take and give me your bet. Well, I think what the fight really comes down to is who's a better striker. And I think most people will agree that's Jose Aldo. And really nothing else matters. Takedown defense will be, might be an issue because um, Eric Koch does have a solid wrestling background, but I definitely don't think he's going to be able to take down Jose Aldo in this fight. And I don't think Jose Aldo is going to take him down either. So it's pretty much going to be a striking bout. And I got to favor Jose Aldo there. We haven't seen really anyone be able to do anything to him on the feet. He has very, very good defense, both in terms of blocking with his arms and as well as head movement. Good power, good speed. He's very good with footwork, setting up angles. Eric Koch is also a very good striker, but I just think he's a bit worse there. A bit worse in the defense department, footwork, speed. Maybe he even has a slight edge, actually, goes to uh, Eric Koch in terms of power. Um, the shot he knocked out Rafael Asunso with was very impressive, uh, moving backwards with a short little left hook. And who knows, maybe he can land something on Aldo and, and put him out or put him on roller skates and start that at the beginning of the end, but I just don't see it happening. The, the price is steep on Jose Aldo, but i got to bet it on him. I just can't see him losing this fight. So Luca Fury is going to lay the steep price. It's going to be 1925 to win 500 on Jose Aldo, the champion. Now let's get Matty Simo's thoughts. Matty, do you agree or disagree with Luca? You know, uh, Luca raises some great points. Um, I totally agree with the way uh, you know he thinks the fight's going to go. But just because of that, you know, like possibility that there could just be like one shot that ends the fight, I'm going to take my uh, shot with uh, Coke as the uh, plus 285 underdog. Um, now, Coke, for people who aren't familiar with him, he's a 23-year-old kid from Iowa. I think he's got some great value here. He reminds me a little of Bantamweight contender Mike McDonald, a similar fighter with knockout power. Um, three of his last four fights have ended in the first round. I watched the UFC at 149 press conference earlier today, and he seemed very hungry and excited you know, for this title shot. He's mentally strong. His only loss is to Chad Mendes, who ironically suffered his, his first career loss to Jose Aldo. Now he's got seven submission wins, three by knockout, and two of his last three are knockout of the night honors. Um, he's coming off an unanimous decision win over uh, Ultimate Fighter 12 winner Jonathan Brookins. And, um, I think another thing to consider is the three-inch height advantage he has that could come into play. You know, we saw that with Nate Diaz beating Jim Miller. If it is, you know, a stand-up fight, that three inches could be the difference. And like you said earlier, if it's one shot, I'll take my three-to-one odds on my uh, coke here. Okay, great stuff from Maddie on this fight. You are going with Eric Koch as the underdog, plus 285, so it's going to be 500 to win 1425. And we'll see if Eric Koch is the man to dethrone Jose Aldo at UFC 149. Well, that's it for another episode of MMA Odds Breakers. You can look for the odds that Nick broke right here on the show to start popping up at the sport books throughout the coming week. And a big special thanks to our two guests, Maddie Simo and Luca Fury. Thanks again, guys. A lot of great information. Also, make sure you check out our new website, MMAOddsBreaker.com. And for all the latest show updates, make sure you follow us on Twitter, at MMAOddsBreaker. For Miguel Adorati, I'm Nick Kalika saying until next time, enjoy the fights.